Alright guys, we're back to another Icarus Proud Bottom Adventure. Today it's World of Typing Weekly, which was a series that came out after the previous one we had played where Satan was trying to take over the world with his contracts. So, yeah, we'll see if we can play through them all. I don't know how long they actually are. Oh, it's not going through my headset. Help! Now it goes through my headset, hopefully. Okay. Where do you live? We need to know whether or not... U.S. There we go. Now it's gone to the headset. Icarus Proud Bottoms World of Typing Weekly! Oh. I've been waiting for you. Me too. Yes, you player, the player, welcome back. But be warned. Something horrible has happened. Something terrible in the place is afoot. Oh ye gods. Make sure your seat has a firm and well-constructed edge. Because that's where you shall be for the duration of this tale. Here we go. <laughs> uh oh. So, before I can begin to investigate the crime, I need to know the story. The player is going to ask you some. <coughs> excuse me. Ask you some questions. Please, please answer as directly as possible. Before we start, do you have any questions, Jerry? No, I am as ready as I ever shall be. Okay, then let's begin. Please answer this question. It happened on the day of the incident. Tell me. So much to tell. Where does one even start? Holy cow. It is a tale of mystery, of murder, and of typing. I suppose I shall start where all stories start. At the beginning. Hello there! Welcome to Icarus's Power Bottoms at World Typing Weekly. I'm Icarus Power Bottom. I'm the main character. And this is my little sidekick, Jerry. Yes, I am the Alkin known as Jerry. Howdy. Jerry's an American spirit animal. He's over 2,000 years old. 2,000 years. Think about that. This dude is old as hell. <laughs> Thanks, Icarus. No problem, Jerry. We came to teach typing and chew bubblegum. And we're all out of typing. So we're going to chew bubblegum. No, wait. Gum. We're all out of gum. Oh, forget it. On a scale from 1 to 10, we both really love typing. But enough about us. Let's talk about you. Tell me a little bit about yourself. Oh, wow. This is like Mass Effect. Here's a psychological profile. As a child, you suddenly developed an intensive, obsessive love of typing. You disconnected from your peers and family and spent your life in isolation mastering the art of typing. Your acts of valor in the second typing war have earned you respect among your peers. Your typing skills have come naturally and you feel a little need to practice. At a young age, your family was killed in a vicious typing accident, summoning your inner strength. You spent your childhood mastering the art of typing so the same fate would never be befall you. You take a holistic view of typing. You understand the inner meaning of key placement and approach typing with an open mindset bordering on mysticism. You type with a take no prisoner approach. You jam your hands into the keyboard as fast as humanly possible. Typos be damned. When it comes to typing, time, when it comes time to type, you approach the keys head on fiercely. You strike each key with amazing force. I want luck. Your keystrokes can be heard from miles away. Your fingers are thick and meaty after years of hard I don't think so. You believe that fast typing comes from the mind, not the body. You have memorized the keyboard layout and have even stumped- no. You manage to impress your typing classmates with your charm and wit. When you are unable to type yourself, you could- I guess it'd be strength. Whatever. Oh wow, this is Mass Effect. There's a lot of questions. Where were your parents from? United Earth Colonies. Your parents grew up in the smoldering, overheated ruins of Old Earth. Only they, though, through typing, were they able to muster up the resources required to support the family. Your parents were asteroid miners who spent their lives on various space stations. <clears throat> Having never experienced gravity, their bones were frail, yet their typing was strong. 
Your parents spent their life in the underwater sanctuaries. High pressure, humidity, and octopus attacks molded them into quiet, severe individuals. Typing kept them quite sane. Generating your character now! Cal Calucotting Ancestry. Done. Generating facial features. Error. Oh, done. Finalizing calculations. Error. There's gonna be an error somewhere. Oh, done. Character cr Oh, what the hell? Huh. I'm a goof. Well then. Wow, that's quite a backstory. You seem like a pretty cool guy or girl. Um, in retrospect, maybe we should have put gender in there. You didn't learn from the last game? You want to play the tutorial. You probably do if you haven't. I've already played it. No need. No need! I believe the player is ready. Oh yeah, enough talk. Let's get down to it. Do it to it. Let's start with this incredible paragraph. Ready? Weekly. Tune in every week for an incredible typing adventure. Anything can happen in the world of typing! Whoa, that's S plus 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 plus. Dear God, is it possible your good time been prowling has grown since we last met? Anyways, we'll be right back after this loading screen. Untyping fact, you can tweet any line of dialogue to the Twitterverse or whatever by clicking it with your mouse. I don't think that's true. Ah, nice and loaded. Let's continue. Ba-ding, ba-ding. Most odd. Someone is at the door? At the door? Who the heck could that be? Is it Satan? Oh, well, probably just one of our many fans. Let's let him in. Oh, shoot. He's got a horn on his head. <clears throat> oh, that's Elvis. Holy craps. Holy craps. It is my cousin Apollo. Um, what the heck are you doing here? My freaking cousin Icarus. See you now. Wow, what a feeling. My emotions are now are like, whoa, how long has it been, man? Is there somewhere we can talk, catch up a little bit? Like, is that a freaking owl? I am an ancient American Indian spirit animal. Anyways, why don't you two catch up in the storm, Drew? I can take over to teach you for a while. Thanks, Jerry. If you need me, you know where you can find me. <laughs> but Icarus, my man, my dude, how has life been? Pretty great, Apollo. Let me show you why. Oh, you got his license tag. It's this, Apollo. It's all about this. My license to type. Look at my face there. Oh crap, he's bugging. Look at the pride, the happiness. The car represents the culmination of my life accomplishments, Apollo. <laughs> wow, listen to me prattle on about myself. What a selfish butthole moron doofus I am. Apollo, what's new with you? Well, let me tell you. And that's where it all began. So Apollo and Icarus went to talk alone in the storage room. Interesting. How long before the incident was this? Not long. Maybe ten minutes. Interesting. Everything happened so quickly. One more question, player. Track. Oh my gosh. Did anything strike you as suspicious at the time? No, at the time everything seemed normal. There was no sign of the events to come. Anyways, allow me to tell you what happened next. So, Icarus and his cousin Apollo were chatting in the side room. While we wait for Icarus to return, shall we type? Some typing advice from yours, truly. I'm typing, don't just... 
just use your primary feathers. Try using your secondary feathers as well. Resist the urge to peck the keys with your beak. Don't hunt peck these, Sand. As this can damage, oh, the keyboard. Grip your chair firmly with your talons. Should you need to top up a pellet, turn your head 270 degrees before doing so. 270 degrees, like. I <laughs> can't do it. Oh well. Your vice sucks. A job most incredible. <clears throat> that Satan? Again? What the heck? Weird. We never get guests at this place. We're coming. I guess I'll get. Gods, I'm a spirit animal, not a freaking butler. I don't even have a salary. Whoa. Oh, it's a female. It's like the first female ever. Hi, I'm looking for your first power bottom. Is he here? Holy crap, an ancient American Indian spirit animal. Hi, I'm Jerry. Icarus is in the side room talking with his cousin Apollo. Shall I retrieve him for thee? Sure, if you don't mind. It's kind of important that I speak to him now. Okay. Just hold up just for a second while I grab him. This will be a seamless stranger quest, but... Do you think you can teach typing while I'm gone? Typing? Did you say typing? I actually know a lot about typing. In fact, you could say that typing is kind of my life. I'm one of the top members of the ITC, International Typing Council. Wow, we have an RTP, real typing professional here. I'll be back in a minute. Huh. Well, looks like I'm the teacher now, for now. I assume Icarus and Jerry have taught you the fundamentals? No. Huh. Well, I suppose that's just like Icarus. Anyways, let's start with hand position. Oh, Lord. I know what you're thinking. Too easy. Wow, what is this jumbled garbage? It's the homo key. I got it. Relax, it's easy if you use a little PHP. Proper hand position. Ha! Huh. So get your hand into position now. Place your index finger on F and your right one on J. Jesus, they're actually teaching now. Put your hand in the right position. This could only take a few seconds. Thank you. <sighs> wow. Not bad. Let's do one more and expand on it. Oh, Lord. Oh, I don't like this. You'll need to jump up and down the keyboard rows for this one. Again, place your left index finger on F and your right finger index finger on J. The problem with that's gonna be is when we go to the bottom keys, because I actually never thought about hitting those keys, they just kinda come. With your hands resting in this position, all keys are within easy reach. Oh, thank God. Didn't go to the bottom keys. Hey, Jerry said we had another guest. Lucidia? Icarus, can you spare a moment? Yes, absolutely. Jerry, Apollo, uh, am I waiting out here for a second? Again with the closet. Ah, <sighs> hi. Go, oh, cousin. The owl and I will hang out here. This should take just take a minute. This way, Lucida. Goodness. Don't tell me already. Yes, already. This soon. Wow. This probably means that the news can't be good. Well, that's why I'm here, Icarus, to break the news. What happened was. Gosh. So, the second guest arrived shortly after the first. Interesting. Yes, an unusual occurrence in this place. So this all happened just minutes before the incident. Player, a question for Jerry?
Have you messed this woman before? No. Although it turns out Icarus knew her well. Allow me to complete the story. Hmm. Icarus seems surprised to see her. I wonder what that's about. Does this happen a lot? Lots of lady visitors, lots of a uh, demand for Icarus's time? If so, wow, I've got to quit my job and become a typing teacher. Oh, nothing like this has happened before. A woman has never seeked out Icarus's attention before, ever. Anyways, the typing. We have to teach the typing. Guess what time it is. It's time for an exam. Yay! Holy moly, looks intense. Let's test your let's test your speed. Looks like random nonsense, no? Ha! Fooled you. Owned. It's not random at all. The key to winning this is understanding the pattern. Going up yeah, I get it. It's going up and down. It's not hard. Also, since this is an exam, you're tight. actually gonna be kind of hard but I... oh my god yeah going uh I don't like it when they rely on the bottom row keys, that's really hard for me. Ah, I see. The player had to go from left to right, up to down, or whatever. Neat, I guess. So, that's how you teach typing, okay? That's not how I would teach it, but okay. I'm back. Uh, where's Icarus? Still in the back room? He said he'd be out in a second. Huh. Weird. He's not usually one to miss out on type. Something doesn't feel right here. Hey, oh, what the H was that? Um, not sure. Let's check on Icarus. He's still in the back room. Interesting. Very interesting. All right, gross. Pitch black in here. Hold up, I'll get the light. Oh crap, he's dead! Not actually dead, he just passed out kids, he'll be fine. Probably. Oh you god, Sickers Proudbottom is dead! My cousin. Holy craps. What the? Who the? Why the? How the? How or why this has come to pass is unknown, but one thing seems certain. Hold on, I want to change my outfit before I deliver the next line. Okay, I'm ready to deliver my line now. The killer is someone in this room. To us, how it happened. And then I was summoned shortly after to investigate the crime. So, oh, are you telling me anything, everything? Have you missed any details? No, that is the full story. Okay, Jerry. Thank you for your cooperation. I think that's a good, f that's good for the first session. Before we go, let me ask one more question. I'll be blunt. Did you kill Icarus Proudbottom? No, no. But I know not what I can do to prove my innocence to you at this time. However, I suspect this with time and effort and typing, the mystery may be solved. You are absolutely correct, my feathered friend. Okay, you can go now. Okay, I shall. P.S. out now. Peace. Okay then, that didn't go so badly. Now, before I forget any details, let me jot down some notes. Or let me jot down some notes, probably. Let's type it out together. 
I don't like his shadow. It just changed like dramatically. I think he's Satan. Icarus Proud Bottom Case. Day one. Who killed Icarus Proud Bottom? Was it Jerry? The American Indian spirit animal? Apollo? Icarus's cousin? Lucida? The mysterious acquaintance? Or is the answer something else entirely? It was Satan! Who's making me type this? I gotta say, despite all the unknowns, I'm feeling optimistic. In fact, I'll make a prediction right now. Oh, he's a robot. Together, player, we will crack this case. I would have been together, player, we will crack this case. <laughs> yes, it is true. Icarus Proud Bottom is dead. This may be the most event tragic event in typing history. Which is really say something. As we all know, typing history is rife with tragedies. Who killed Icarus Proud Bottom? The investigation begins in the next week's episode. That's a creepy looking mugshot. For real. That is scary looking. Alright guys, that was episode one. We'll do these like in uh, parts, I guess. We'll do like one part per episode. Because honestly, I think there's like six episodes. So if I did it all at once, it'd be like a two hour video. Pretty neat the game though. I do love, I love typing games. All right guys, is that it? All right. Thanks for watching as always guys. If you like videos like these, please like and subscribe and I will be streaming shortly. I'll be playing uh, Don't Alive if you want to jump in, ask me any questions, hit me up with whatever, but yeah. Bye!